Right guys, so last day uh, for this week in Barcelona. Uh, I'm just about to get into the car now and uh, I'm gonna fly to Vigo and Santiago. Uh, that's the third time this week that I'm doing that combination and it's been really good weather for, for the previous days, but today there's rain coming in and it's supposed to be um, almost 300 meters in fog in Santiago this evening. Uh, I was supposed to do line training, but as I mentioned in the uh, previous episode, uh, the line training captain that I was supposed to be training fell ill yesterday, so he had to offload himself and he's still sick today. So I'm going to fly with a normal first officer, no training today, uh, which is nice for a change. So uh, come with me and uh, let's see what, uh, what happens. So that is the week done. Me and uh, my uh, excellent first officer Mark has been uh, flying four sectors now. So we're just waiting for all the passengers to disembark and then we are going to go to the crew room and finish up the last paperwork and then I will get back into my car and drive back to Girona. It's been a good day. Actually the weather in Santiago was much worse than expected. Um, it was forecasted to be about, I think about 4,000 meters, wasn't it? 4,000 meters. Yeah, 4,000 meters it was forecasted to be. We, landed with 2,000 meters and we took off with I think 350 meters of VR. so that just goes to show that even though the forecast is saying that the weather is supposed to be in a specific way it doesn't mean that it actually will be that when you reach so we had plenty of fuel with us and we knew that this might be the case so we uh, we um, well we ended up landing after having done the Cat3 approach and guys if you want to see how to do a Cat3 approach in the Mentor Aviation app there is a, a playlist a collection about how to fly Cat3 approaches, both with go-arounds and with landings. So, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed this vlog, and uh, I will. Um, well, I'll see you in the next one. Take care.